Hey everybody, Chase the Pierce family here, bringing you the first episode of our newest Let's Play. And we are going to be playing Moonlighter. This is a game that was recommended to me by one of my friends. Uh, they talked about how it's an amalgamation of other games we've played. As far as I know, there is a story mode that we can play through. Um, I've never played it. I've never even seen what it looks like. Um, so we'll be playing this completely blind, and we'll see how it goes. So, I guess let's get started. Uh, so let's type new... Okay, new... I don't have new game plus. Wizards are created by the developers recommended for most players. For those who want to focus on the story... Um, we'll go with hard. We'll go with the recommended difficulty. Does not bother me at all. So we're gonna we're probably gonna be playing around with the camera movement a little bit, a little bit um, if it's not what I can do in post processing. Among the stars of night, there is a land as old as imagination. Ooh. One night, mazes full of extraordinary treasures and deadly creatures appeared on this land. In this land, they called them the dungeons, strange, ever-changing ruins of unknown lands. Soon a village of the slightly curious took root near the dungeons. This they named Rhinoka? Rhinoka? On the settlers, two groups shine bright as heroes and merchants, glory and riches. The dungeons proved too dangerous. They were soon closed as too many lives were lost in their depths. Life became hard for the town, especially for the young owner of the oldest shop, Will of Moonlighter. Long dream of opening the mysterious fifth door the dungeons. Ooh. Continue. Okay, so I guess we're gonna play until we open the fifth door. That'll be the end. Oh, what is this? I'm not doing anything right now. I'm controlling nothing. Why is our style though? Oh! What is this? Oh, I can control now. So it's teaching me the controls. So this is saying use, I guess, you can, so you can use the analog stick. Can I, and I can use the D-pad too to move around. So let's go uh, this way, I guess. Oh. Left trigger is a roll, okay. So I can roll whatever direction I'm moving. Can I like... I can quickly like kind of move back. Roll backwards. Okay. So we have a roll. Oh, look at that. In the corner. X and A do stuff. We can't do anything with them yet. Oh, left button. I'm really bad at using the bumpers. On oh, controllers. Oh, I can... Okay, so I can roll over gaps. How big of a gap can I roll over? Okay. Pretty big gaps. Oh, that was a mistake. Okay, so it's like room based. Okay, so yeah, if you touch him, he kills you in this scenario. Uh, but you can roll through him. Okay, you can roll through enemies. Got it. Check. Roll through dangers. Okay. So we have A. Okay. Let's kind of do this, and then right trigger. Oh! Oh, right trigger to use a health potion. Got it. Well, I'm just use a health potion right now. So, right trigger to heal. Well, let's clear all this out. Yeah, give me all this. Oh, there's two up, two up here. Nothing. What? What? Is this a broom? We clean this place up. Okay. 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 We're getting some equipment stuff. This is A to open the chest. Uh. Foundry rests. 
Do I have to do this? Like this? Uh, quick move all. Okay, cool. L sorts. Oh. Sorted by price, sorted by culture, sorted by price. Okay. Uh, an RT. Oh, puts it back over. Rich jelly. Okay. Oh, no, no, that's right. Bumper. What does right trigger do? Oh, okay. This is a book that will tell me about stuff. Okay, so. Oh, man. Settling and reactions. Wait a minute. My broom spear, HP potions. Should always have one or two on hand. Uh, this is like stats you can see for damage and whatnot. Selling reactions, I guess. Oh. Oh, oh okay. All right. Well, we're. We grabbed everything, we're gonna close that. <laughs> oh man, oh man, okay. Uh, move all, let's take it all. What is this? A broken sword and some ancient pot? Oh! Oh! Oh, come on, stop spraying me. What in the world? This seems like a lot. This seems like a lot. I'm just gonna say it. This seems like a whole lot. This seems like a whole lot happening right now. Ugh. 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 No. No, I want this stuff. Give me this stuff. Ugh. Roll, 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 roll. Okay. Jeez, um. There's no way we're getting through that with what we have. Mm, that was one of rough fights. As well as fights that they don't want, they don't want anyone being able to beat, not even someone who's good. What a sorry looking kid. All alone now. Rest for a bit, Will. I have you now. What? I have you now. Hmm. It's kind of a weird one. I'm not guaranteed to be good at this. Home shop. Oh, this goes into the home, and then you go back to the, to the shop. Okay. Even as a mere child, barely able to walk, you were curious of the dungeons. The schematics and stuff I see. There is no doubt you carry the same obsession as old Pete. Hmm? Morning, boy. Got a little merchant bought off more than he could manage. To be fair, that was very unfair. Will, listen to me. The hard truth is this. You're the last of your family. The only one left to run Moonlighter. You can't keep pushing yourself like this. Risking your life on this fifth door nonsense is foolish. Just leave it. Find some artifacts, then use your pendant to get out of the dungeon. And for crater's sake, stop using that broom of yours, you daft boy. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Okay. It's mine from back in the day. Use it. I have little need for it now. It's a sword and shield. Well, the references are crazy. Now then, get up. You're wasting light. Can't you, can't have you neglect the shop all day. Let's see if I can get through your let's see if I can get through your hard head some of the tricks that I picked up from your grandfather so many many years ago. Okay. Let's see. Can't really do anything. Oh. Successfully selling your merchandise takes knowledge of two things. You must know an item's value as well as its demand. Come now, open the shop and allow customers to come in. Uh, okay. Uh, open the shop. Alright, here, here we go. Alright, come on. What you got? What's up? Oh, uh, yeah. You see that? Best expression you can hope for. The item wasn't too expensive for them, and not so cheap for you to lose profit. Be sure to pay attention to your customer's expressions. That's how your grandfather always knew if his prices were fair. Okay, all right, well, welcome, welcome. Uh, that crystal is 170, sir. 170. Oh, he doesn't like it. 
I don't think I need to tell you that I was obviously overpriced. Lesson learned. Finally, be careful of selling a popular item too much. If you flood the market, you have to offer a cheaper price on your wares. Point is, charge higher when something is in high demand and low in, and, and low in supply. Take out your emerging notebook. It should hold all the information you have gathered on discovered wares and artifacts. Okay, alright. Alright, so that so there's crystallized energy. Why again it wants me to be okay. Uh, well, it seems the sun has seen the sun has fallen for the day. I best head off. You will pick up more on your own. Restoring this shop to its full glory, that responsibility falls on you, not I. It's in your blood. Will make us proud. In the meantime, why don't you try out that new sword of yours? Dungeons are more are more perilous at night. But one can always find better artifacts. Just don't die too far. Use that pendant, boy. Okay. Well. Go on now, those weary bones of mine must rest. Where which way do I go? Dungeons. Okay. To the dungeons. Oh, okay, so that's a So X is now swipe and shield is block. X is uh X is block and A is swipe. Uh, so what we got? Are these all sealed off? Ooh, this thing is looking nice and spicy. Alright, so everything is sealed off except for this first one. The Golem Dungeon. Dungeon available to he merchants and heroes. Okay, well. I don't know how to use my pendant. It's the only problem. I don't really know what that means. Or is. Golem dungeon. Okay, so we have a little map in the bottom corner. Um, what is B? Is B my pendant? What does this do? Oh, this switches weapons. Okay. So I set up my broom. Let's go up. Alright, let's fight. Cool. Got a stick. Nice. We happy about that. We happy. Ooh. Whatever this is looks... All right. Uh, does, does breaking these do anything? If I break all these, and I don't find anything. I'm just gonna assume they're always empty. And they're just like for aesthetic. Okay. Oh. Let's go. Nice, nice. Oof! Okay, so if I can... Hmm, okay. So can I just, uh... I just block all damage? Oh. Hello? Hello? Are you alive over here? Hello? Uh, to a person of hopefully far better luck than I, my time is short. I took injury from the strange creature across the room. Okay. My pendant all but shattered from the scuffle. Check him out, though. I'd say I uh, fared better than he. He caught me spying on him near the Guardian's room. He dropped a couple items when he fled, one of which is this map diagram? Whatever it is, I was right. Call me crazy, said old crazy Pete. Oh, done gone, lost his marbles. I was right. Each guardian of the dungeon must possess a key of sorts. All of them linked to that giant locked door outside the dungeons. The fifth door of Rainoke. Sadly, I won't be around to see the door open. To whomever whoever found me, I apologize for the smell, but the diagram should be around here somewhere. Please open the fifth door of Rainoke. The dungeons are not what they seem. This guy had a okay. Big boss gonna kill me. I supposed to let them all out. Now I have to chase this weird creature that stole my stuffs. Ah, big boss gonna be so upset with little me. Alright, so if we get all the dungeons, we'll open the fifth door. Easy. Oh, look at all this stuff. Oh, what is this? Okay, so that's the pendant. 
when it gets fully charged, you can hold B, and that will return you home. Is there a way I can... Oh, that's not what I want to do. Oh, I'm locked in here, so this is the end, so I can just charge B and teleport out. Wow, escaped with pendant. So I killed six enemies, I found no chest. I got all this stuff, though. Okay. That seemed eventful. I don't... I don't really understand the selling... The selling portion of this. Oh, I am... I am burdened with stuff. Oh, maybe I wasn't moving. I, I can't... I can't tell. Ah, the Emperor of Moonlighter has returned. You look in... You look intact. Finally learned to use that pendant properly. It's about time, boy. What are you holding? Is that chart of the dungeons? Where'd you get this? You... Found old Pete. Dead. See, this is what happens when you chase what's behind that door. Leave it, Will. To get the artifacts you need from the Golden Dungeon, and look after Moonlighter. Now, I noticed some posts on the board that may interest you. Some shops want to move in, attempt to revitalize this town. Apparently, they need uh, some startup capital first. It would be nice to see some new life in Rainoke. Nice indeed. Hmm. What's it to do with me? I mean, I guess I'm supposed to like make the town grow and stuff. Oh, there's the boards. Okay, we'll go over there. We'll check it out. Ooh, da, da, da. Let me read this. Investments. Town or shop? Okay. You know the dungeons are too hard to have your old weapon. I can solve that if you bring me enough money and materials. A forge to be reckoned with. Interesting. Oh, these guys want lots of money, huh? So 500 for you, 500 for you, 55. Okay, so what, what do you have? The wooden hat. Brute, if, is brute force getting you nowhere in the dungeon? Visit the wooden hat to find potions and enchantments for this and that. Okay. And I do investments for the shop. Oh, so this is like for bigger and better shops. Shop expansion, okay. Okay, cool. I keep hearing, uh, I keep hearing an old rumor around the town about the dungeons. Maybe, but that maybe particular artifacts are easier to find at night. Okay, so how do, how do I do this? Uh, okay, so first thing I want to do is I want to do, do this. Here we go, this is what I want to do. So 170 is a little too high. Let's try 120. Nice. All right, so what is this? Vine, iron bars, golem cores. Tether stones, rich jellies, roots, uh, foundry rest. I don't know anything about this stuff. Okay. Alright, so these are all new items and stuff that I can sell, looks like. What in the world? Okay, so these things are worth 275 and less. And less. Sturdy but rough to the touch. I imagine someone would want to use this in the creation of decorations. Broken sword, fairly useless in its current form, but it can be easily smelt down to craft something new. I believe uh, this is the old foundry. The golems are created. What created them? Oh man, ancient pot. And a small crack or two, but could, but could still hold something beautifully crafted. Curious for what it could have been used for. All right, let's 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 try to. Let's try to put some stuff down, I guess. I don't, I, I don't, I don't really know. Okay, so this is all stuff I could sell? Let's grab a stack of tin. What in the world? I don't know, sell them for like 30 each? Oh, I am so confused. Uh, let's transfer uh, you, 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 you. This is all people stuff, huh? But maybe I should keep that. No, there's no point keeping it. What? Um, 
Let's do that. Ugh. Yeah, 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 I knew that. Okay. Well, can I go back out into the, uh... Can I go back into the dungeons? I'm at full HP. I still have plenty of healing potions and everything. Let's go for another dive before we, uh, end the episode. We got stuff to do, man. Now, is it the same layout? Not the same layout. Okay. Oh, jeez. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta work on like the timing. All right. A pot you messed up. Pot. Chest I can open up. So what is this? Fabric. Uh, artifact must be placed at the top or bottom of the bag. What? Artifact must be placed to the left or right of the bag. This is interesting. There's some artifacts though. Jeez, come on. Hole, oh, that hurts. Alright. Well, let's deal with uh, other stuff first. Alright, you first. Okay. Health potion. Yeah, if I say I can drink a health potion, that's how much they heal for. Alright. Alright. We can get a hit in and dodge out. Oh! Stop, dude. Okay, okay, so I, 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 I can't do all that. Alright, so I can't get a hit and dodge. Can't get, cannot get a hit and dodge. Um, so, hold on. So, Alright, so if things can only be placed in certain spots, then stuff... Okay. Stuff like this needs to be placed like like that to like make room, I guess. I, I, I don't I don't know. Oh. <laughs> and like that. Okay. Who's got this map? Nice useful map. Anyway, can I uh? How do I... Uh, here we go. Here we go. I don't have anything... Any of these other things. Okay. Uh, Alright. Let's go. It's going to take... A potion. It's going to take a little bit for me to get good at this. I, know I might never get good at it. Alright, so that, is that like uh, the difficulty rating? The number above their head? Are they like a two-star monster or whatever? Or a one-star monster? Over here. Nope. I like hit this body. Oh, I can. Oh. Wait a minute. Ooh. Wait, I'm gonna try this bow out. Doesn't seem to have ammo, so. Pierce too, okay. Come on. You just gotta be able to aim well. Got it. Oh, that's a wall. <laughs> no, I can't go through this. It's a wall. Ooh, what is this? Why? 
Why do our tools keep disappearing? Chambers full of precious stone are left untouched, but rooms and chests holding our most basic tools keep vanishing. Oh, oh, it's a healing fountain. Oh, that's nice. That's nice stuff. Oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Easy. Easy enough. Okay, easy enough. Drink a potion. Dang it. Okay, just gotta watch for the animation. Wait for the animation. Oh, messed that one up. Dang it! Mess that one up. Whew. A little close there, huh? Dang it! Oh, got him! I'm sitting. I, I I'm like so focused. I'm like I, I can't. I can't. I can't. So what does this do? Where does this go? Did I beat it? At the end? At the end of that dungeon? Golem Dungeon 2? Uh, I don't know about this. Alright, this is one of the strange devices that creature dropped when he fled. This one's... This one's rich, actually. Almost quite literally rich. For every item you place in this device, gold of some perceived value drops out. It's great if you need to use your pendant in a pinch. The device looks like a mirror, so I'm just going to call it the mirror. Even as simple. I do wonder, though, where do the treasures dropped inside go? Why am I getting the best deal here? So it turns items into gold. All right. Well, I can leave at any point. So let me, let me let me check this out. A mirror that turns items into gold. What? I missed what happened. <laughs> no, my pot! My pot's gone! I messed it up! Uh... Oh. Merchant, Golem, Forest, Desert. Okay. What in the world? Oh, merchant. Okay, here we go. Golem. Uh, all right. Well, let's 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 just get out of here. I am not really sure what just happened. It like the kind of oh yeah, this is all the people I've beat up. I guess awesome. Cool. I dig it. I have no clue what's going on. Absolutely no clue. But it's daytime, so I should probably go in here and open the shop. Uh, Alright, let's place the pot. How do I, like, can I just go up faster? This seems very slow of a process. So I, want, I want this to be, like, not doing anything. I want this to be like 150. It's an old beautiful pot. It's worth 150. Um, all right, come on. Oh, there we go. Okay, 150. Okay, okay. Open the shop. All right, all right. 
Alright. Hello, sir. Our, pro our, our wares are quite well priced, I, I think. I'm not really sure. How, do you like that? Oh, is it too expensive? Oh, it's too expensive also? Is everything too- Oh! Oh! Really? Low? No, I'm sorry! I don't know how much things cost! Can I talk to you or something? Or I can adjust prices. Alright, guys, it's on sale. There's been a sale all of a sudden. It's a good price. I don't know, I don't know how much you want th for this. Let's try a hundred for this. Let's try a hundred for this. Uh, I have some more iron bars. Uh, 30 is evidently low. So let's, let's do 75, 75 per bar. I want the stack. There we go. All right, look, look, new stuff. Look, it's still too expensive. He likes that. It's too much. He like that too. Okay, okay. Seventy-five is too much. Fifty-five. How about that? Wait, wait, wait. There's more stuff in the back. Wait, ah, uh, ah. Uh, you want equipment? Uh, I don't have any equipment. Uh, uh, oh. Broom spear worth. Oh, jeez, I don't know, man. 70. Let's, let's go with, let's go with 62. Yeah, 62. It's a broom spear. That look nice. That look nice. Yes. What? Okay, okay. I mean, I understand it's a broom. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, how about 40? Here, here, wait, we'll put some more stuff out. What is this? Teeth stone, empowering crystal. Well, this sounds important. There's no way I can make... Jeez. Okay, well, I wish I would have known that. All right, hey, look at those things. Oh no, oh no. Am I just giving this away? Is it still too much? Okay, okay. All right, you people. 45, how about that? It's 45. There's been a price drop. My friends, a price drop. Let's open up my book, man. I don't know what's going on. Are you still upset? Okay, okay. Hold on. What's happening? Where's the iron bar? Oh, it's low priority. Oh, 30 is too much. Oh, 30 was still too much, but they were willing to pay it. What, what else? Neutral. They liked 100. Oh my goodness. Okay. 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 All right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 30 was too much. How about we go for a nice cool 25? Uh 25. What did you what did you guys think about this? What? Oh, what hardens? I have this? I'm confused. I'm confused. Okay, there, there's the stuff. Where is the, uh... No, where's the stuff? Is it? Is that over here? I don't know. Where is, uh... Forest? Where does empowering crystals come from? What is this thing? Empowering crystal. No! Jeez! No! Oh! Uh, trigger. The empowering crystal. Okay. 125 is too much. Raw, pistols, raw, raw crystal source of magic power. Ah! Okay. Once the day's over, 
we're gonna we're gonna have to end it. Uh, okay, so 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 this was this is too much. So let's go down to a hundred. Let's go down to a hundred. Let's see. Oh, I just want this day to be over. Can this day, can this day just be over? Buy some stuff, people. Come on. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah, they like it. A hundred. Good price. Good price. Yes. That's all. That's all you. That's all you. Yeah, I'm. A I actually am enjoying this. This portion. This is low demand. That's fine. Um. Two fifty. Right? Can I like quick? So what does this mean? Does this is this stuff worth more than two seventy five? Three hundred. Three hundo. Take it or leave it. Take it or leave it. Three hundo. It's fine. It's a good price. Yeah. Oh, he loves it. Yes, three hundred. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Oh, sell. So, yeah. Are you kidding me? Okay, you don't have to buy the iron bar. I don't care if you buy them. Uh, let's sell some more of these. Uh, do I see 325? That guy just bought for 300. Well, things change. 325, I see. People are happy with that. <laughs> Alright, just for you, sir. Just for you, sir. Everything is fine here. Don't worry about the prices. We just got some information. 350? Is that too much? So look at it. He wants he wants it. This old man's like, I've been waiting for one of these. Okay, alright. Well, I'm sorry. Okay, price drop. Okay, okay, okay. Sorry, 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 sorry. 330? Here you go. New prices. Can I close up shop? Can I be like, everyone leave? Hold the close shop. I can close the shop. What time is it? Oh, I see it down there. It's still uh, January 3rd, I guess. Yeah, 3.30. All right, 3.30. And have a good day. Have a good day. Oh, it's in low demand, so nobody really wants this stuff. All right, if it's in low demand, let's, uh, let's not even sell it. You know what? You know what? I gotta sell this to you. Uh, the Empowering Crystal sold for one hundo, pretty well. This this sold no 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 I want this. That sold for three hundred. This sold oh for three thirty. No, I want to sell them in stacks of uh, one. So why not? And let's try to figure out how much Golem cores are worth. <sighs> We have no no way of knowing. I started at 100. I started at 100. You guys are the last customers. We're probably going to have... That's a good price. That's a good price. I know it is. Yep, that's a good price. Yep, that crystal's a good price too. I know, I know. Yep, you guys just, uh, just uh, go ahead and enjoy enjoy yourselves. We're gonna, I'm going to ring you guys up. Go ahead and take the crystals. It's nice, good stuff. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Uh, we got some nice cores over here. Oh, oh, yes, we did it. Okay, yes. All right, so we sold ten iron bars. So we're selling them for thirty each. That seems like a lot. We need so much money. It's hardened steel, killer item. Okay, good stuff. So what does this do? Popularity. Okay, iron bars aren't good anymore. Got it. Okay, cool. All right, well, looks like we saved. I'm asleep, because why not? That will save the game. And I think we're going to wrap it up right here. It is now a new day, and uh, we will start again, I guess, in the next episode. I don't really know how quickly I'm supposed to do this game. Uh, I don't know how many sections these golem dungeons have, but it looks like the game is just go through the dungeons, unlock the doors, and that's how we're going to do. Go ahead and give a like, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of the new game we're going to be playing on the channel, Moon Lighter. If you are subscribed to the channel, you want to see more content like this, go ahead and subscribe, become a member of the family. And as always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.